I offer these every week, along with a short teaching. Just click the subscribe link below to be notified through YouTube when I post the recording of the latest one. Or if you'd like to join me live, which I'd really welcome, go down into the description section below and follow the link along to be able to sign up for free. I'm Rick Hansen, and I'm glad you're here. Uh, it just feels like, um, for me, being here feels somewhat like coming home in general. And maybe that's related to the ways in which meditation itself is a kind of homecoming. You know, it is sometimes said that the root of all illness or the root of all sickness is homesickness. And there are many ways to understand that, that deep um, proverb. And the root of all health, therefore, is coming home and being at home, including at home in yourself, at home in the present, at home in the place where you are, uh, at home with all that you're experiencing. So let's meditate together here and come home um, together to that deep place inside that is a kind of refuge from which we can be with and be aware of thoughts and feelings, emotional reactions, desires, flowing through awareness while um, being a witness to them with an increasingly calm and, and deep and stable sense of presence, of beingness that is aware of the ongoing stream of consciousness. That's really the essence of meditation. It's, um, we've all meditated, if only for seconds at a time in our life. And here we're deliberately training in this way of being so that increasingly it tends to pervade and infuse uh, everyday life, even when, even when we're not formally practicing. So let's, let's, uh, let's dive in. Find a posture that helps you to be comfortable and alert. Often it's useful to plant your feet firmly on the floor if you're sitting, you know, help yourself settle into your chair, maybe a little back support um, can be helpful. You can have your eyes open or closed. Uh, kind of a central quality uh, in meditation is a kindness to ourselves. Uh, we're setting aside this time. We're welcoming inner kindness. We're welcoming um, every part of ourselves to the party. Uh, we're welcoming whatever we're experiencing. It's okay. And we're kind of standing up for ourselves inside. If something's painful or difficult, we're helping ourselves to be with it. So here we have qualities of homecoming, landing, arriving. And we have qualities of heartfeltness, including toward ourselves. Let's take a few moments here to explore the combination of the sense of arriving, homecoming, combined with a sense of however you feel it, of being warm-hearted, open-hearted, Together, this is a sense of being present with an open heart.
it's okay if thoughts and feelings, little mini movies pass through awareness, that's fine. Let them come, let them go. Well, you explore what it's like to feel present with an open heart. Maybe particularly aware of the feeling of breathing in the area of the heart. It can help to let attention wander through your body, to feel more and more connected with every part of your body. You can do this systematically, paying attention to different parts of your body, let's say starting with the feet and working your way up to the head or down from the head to the feet. And using this body awareness to deepen the sense of being present with an open heart. If your mind wanders, just come on back. If it's uncomfortable to be aware of your body, that's quite common. It's okay. If you like, you could be aware of the room that you're in, a sense of its spaciousness and stability, stable floor, sturdy walls, solid ceiling,
whether you're aware of your body or the room that you're in, it's a way to establish yourself in a sense of place. With a sense of okayness. So it's all right to be open hearted and stably present. You can be gently intentional about remaining present. You can be gently determined to stay present, making the minimal but necessary effort to remain present and undistracted, breath after breath. From time to time, you can recognize what it's like to rest with a open and kind heart while staying stably present. What's this like? And you can be aware of what feels good about it. 
which will help to internalize it, help to establish this way of being in you. In its way, it's a combination of being loving and strong together, present and open-hearted together. There might be a sense of being like a mountain the Buddha talked about that. Stable, inviting, rooted. Undisturbed by the storms that pass on by. Can you, can you find a sense of this, of being like a mountain? Accepting and inviting while being strong and enduring and present. You might have a sense of something deep within you, connecting with something deep within the earth. Perhaps a sort of line of energy or an intuition. You 
you like a mountain rooted in the earth. As you inhale, you can explore possibly feeling that something deep inside you in your body, in your diaphragm and belly and pelvic floor and inner thighs and legs. As you inhale, there's a kind of opening there opening downward, opening into the earth. And as you inhale, a kind of rising energy or sensation moving up from below in a ongoing flow, connecting you like a mountain feeling increasingly stable and rooted and strong.
And like from a mountain, you can see very far in all directions. Here in this meditation, you might find a combination of feeling both very rooted and also very open with a heart-open spaciousness of awareness extending in all directions. What's this combination like? Stably rooted while being spaciously open and warm-hearted and aware.